G'day guys, Skylar Stardrift here. I'm just dragging the plays video games. Welcome back to Crash Bandicoot 2, Cortex Strikes Back. In the last episode, Ruination finally stopped ruining my mood. And in this episode, yeah, I have no words. <laughs> the last time we encountered bees, we had a lot of problems. I doubt this time is gonna be any better. So, I guess, without further ado, let's start drifting. I'm sorry, Crash, but I'm going to have to interrupt your yo-yoing. Special gem lies bar beyond a clever deception. Okay, here we go. Wow, he just came straight in for the kill. All right, I can dig under here, that's fine. I was just trying to kill that guy. That's all I was trying to do there. There are 94 boxes in the stage. Watch out for the bees. There are a lot of them this time. I'm gonna dive under here. Can I? No. <laughs> I wasn't sure if I could attack the nitro crates or not, so I thought it worth the risk. Ah! Darn it. I got feed. <laughs> oh, I have no lives. And I got stung again. I crouched so that I could do a crouch jump and instead I ended up getting hurt. I should have do I should have done a spin attack instead. Why is it whenever I start recording the planes decide to use my roof as a skyway? Ugh. I swear, it's almost every time I record, that's when the, that's the busiest time of the day for planes, apparently. Whenever I decide to record. <laughs> Never happens when I'm streaming, though. I normally don't even hear planes at all, but then again, I do have my headphones on, so... I mean, I've got my headphones on now, but I don't have them on properly. I sort of leave one headphone off so I can kind of hear myself talk and leave the other headphone on. But when I'm streaming, I can't really do that! Okay, that's a lot of freaking bees. That's a risk. A risk that wasn't worth it. <laughs> Just have to outrun them. I don't want to stand too close to those nitro crates. <laughs> Underground. Get out of here, bees. Careful. Back back under. Yeah, I saw you, bees! Get out of here! Whoa, he's fast! He is freaking fast! Why is he so fast? Holy guacamole! What was Sonic the Hedgehog speed, man? You can't do that in a Crash game! Underground! Yeah, nice try, bees. <laughs> yeah, I'll throw you with nitro crates. So I suggest you back off. Alright. Go around. Ah, oh, hmm. I was standing behind him, but apparently it counted. Ah. Nope. Thank you. At least I can now grab this freaking box behind that. Ugh. Yeah, ha! Zip! 
<laughs> you bees are good for one thing. Exploding nitro crates when I need to. That's all you're good for. <laughs> ah! I had to go back. Oh, what? I ducked under that. Ugh. Oh, come off it. I don't understand why those nitro crates jump like that. I'm pretty sure they never did in the original. I don't recall them doing so. The trouble is, when there's a bunch of nitros around, it's always an odd number. Like, it's always the weird, always a weird one that just jumps up in the air. It's really awkward. Out. Ah. Pop out. Jump over. Careful of this guy. I don't think I can spin attack him. Just gonna go. Ah. Oh, press the circle button too late. Ah. I knew this was gonna be problematic. I'm not having any trouble getting into the ground, fortunately, but... Ah. Take that, you. You fools. Alright. <sighs> okay. Just gonna go. Ah, again with that freaking electric gate, man. <laughs> I killed everything. Nice job. Okay. Now then. We can just step on these nitro crates as if they're nothing. Remember that clever deception? Well, this is where we gotta go. Okay. Well, I picked up the gem. Ah. Then died immediately. Of course I did. I'm gonna get a game over. Phew, that was lucky. Please don't game over. Please don't game over. I also don't know where this is gonna put us when we come back either, so that could be a problem in and of itself. I did already get the gem, didn't I? Whoa. Hi! How did you not explode? That's how. Because you were waiting to kill me. So I could get a game over and have to restart the level. I see you, game. I know what you're up to. I don't like it. Alright, let's try this again. Aside from that, it wasn't really too bad. Again, with the silly mistakes that were costing me, so... Now I know the level a little bit better. There was also that one part, though. That was really doing my head in. So far, so good. Ah. 
Over nitros, back into ground. Oops, just a little too close to the nitro crates there. Oh no! Ah, the gate wasn't the gate wasn't timed like I thought it was. Ah. The last time I came through there, the gate was timed pretty darn well, so... Eh. Coming under. If only I could accidentally spin one of the bees into... This totem pole guy. Ah. It's okay, I'll take the hit. I managed to get through it, so... Ha 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 ha! Quad... Quintuple ran... Whammy. There we go. Free life from that, and onto the purple gem path. As much as I just want to skip it because I've already picked up the purple gem. Well, I will have picked up the purple gem, but I kind of want to make sure there's no boxes here. That hunter and that rat. Badger, armadillo, whatever it is. Literally the worst thing. I just can't time it properly. It's nice to know that I can just outrun them, the bees, just slightly. Okay. Let's try that again. I'm determined to get through this. You can chuck ruination at me, you can chuck cold hard crash at me, and you can chuck even more bees at me, but I swear to all hell I will beat this game if it's the last thing I do. Come off it! I ran up an armadillo's backside! Ah. Get out of here. As well, there's no place for people like you. Aha! No, 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 no. Yeah, nice try, buddy. You can smack your hammer all you want, but it's gonna do you no good at all. Okay. Seems about to be every two runs or so I'm gonna get an extra life, so... Oh, come off it, game. Come on. I swear, it feels like the hit protection is just slightly off in this game from the original. But then again, I haven't played the original that much, to be honest. The original game is... well, the second game, I should say, is the one that I've probably played the least, actually, because I actually owned Crash Bandicoot 1 and Crash Bandicoot Warped but I could never find Crash Bandicoot 2, ever. Now this is after the um, PS2's release, by the way, so of course it would be difficult to find. Just like Spyro the Dragon, I didn't know Crash Bandicoot existed until the PS2. That's because I largely stayed away from anything on Nintendo, and I'm glad that I've grown out of that. Because that's just a silly mindset to be in, really. Ah, And that armadillo is a literal piece of crap. Literal piece of crap. 
They all are. I don't know how to beat them. That's the problem. I just don't know how to beat those stupid armadillos. I'm sure there's a way, because I've beaten them several times, but I don't know what that way is. I'm not sure if it's a body slam to break the armor, or what. I'm quite happy to just bounce on them and leave them be. Thank goodness I made that. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna deal with that. <laughs> I'm just gonna crawl under that. Just make sure there's no box up the top there. Ah! I think I'm gonna have to jump over that, aren't I? Ah. Uh. I think I'm gonna have to jump over that. Of course, if I can keep the Akawaku until that point, which is highly unlikely, then that would be great. Knowing my luck, this probably puts me too far into the level and I'm gonna have to backtrack the boxes. Anyway, so... Alright. Huh. Careful. See, now that broke his armor, but... Uh, that was the Akawaku doing that. So, I'm not sure. Really not sure about it. Oh, come off it, game. Come on. Please just let me through. Please. I'm asking really nicely now. Ah. Of course, this game is not going to listen because it's not a sentient being. Would be nice to have a little luck, though. Wish my luck playing. That was just stupid. That was just stupid. 110 levels of stupid right there, buddy. Alright. Come on. We can do this. Won't take much at all. Again, what's keeping me alive is the ability of collecting all those Wampa Fruit and basically getting an extra life. That's what's keeping me alive. That's what's keeping me going. It happened in Cold Hard Crash and it's kind of happening here too. Those mushrooms are awkward. There's probably not even a freaking box in here anyway. But for the sake of doing it, I've got to sh I want to show it off. So, because I don't know what else is there. As well as reassurance too. So it may just be a box at the end of this. Although, it doesn't look like there's going to be a box. Just from what I'm seeing, but... Ooh, I almost jumped too far. Okay. Not gonna deal with that. Now. Oh 
Ah, oh, really? Two there. Two. I don't know how to get around two. I can get around one because I've got a freaking Aku Aku hit now. But I can't get around two, game. Ah. Uh, how are you supposed to get around that? Aside from getting a good run up, it seems. Seems get a good run up. Yeah, thanks, game. The checkpoint here isn't going to help me at all. I appreciate the effort, game, but that's not going to help. Because that's actually going to make my life worse. Because <laughs> now I won't be able to save up the Akawa... The Akawa... The Wampa Fruit. Here, so... Hi, buddy. Coming through. Don't mind me. Okay, there we go. That's better. Ow. Oh! Ah! And now I don't have the Aku Aku, so I'm screwed. Thanks, game. Thanks, game. You took away all my privileges by putting that freaking ch pity checkpoint there. Thank you, but no thank you. Ugh. Basically what I've got to do is I've got to jump over that, slide under that, then jump over that, then slide under that, slide under this one, jump over that, not jump in the pit. Wow! Ah! My feet didn't even leave the ground. Well, I'm not getting an extra life, it's game over there. I freaking hate this game. I really freaking hate it. Ah, ha, ha. Oh, I'm rushing. Stop rushing. He rushed. You rushed and you got a game over. Game over. You were doing so well. So well. I'm tempted to have another go. But this episode is gone on for long enough. Screw you, game. Well, once again, we've hit another roadblock. This time, it's behaving. Let's hope we can get it next time. I hope so. Kind of over this now. Ugh. See you guys on the flop side when we tackle behaving and actually complete it, I hope. Catch you then, and thanks for watching.